Alright, so I have a fallish fall um, art project for y'all today. We're going to be working with leaves and it's so easy to do. What we're going to be doing first is what's called leaf rubbing. I've already done a dogwood leaf right here. I'm going to take this wall, no, hickory, this is hickory uh, leaf right here. And all you got to do is take it, put it underneath your piece of paper, take a sharpened pencil, and you're going to lay it quite flat. You don't want to be up and down like this. You want to be quite flat. And you rub it on your paper across where you know the leaves are and it shows you exactly where the leaves are underneath. That's pretty cool. I love doing this. Alright, so once I'm done with this hickory here. Oh, I found the stem. It's kind of a thick stem. Lovely. All right. So, first thing to do is to go out and find a different bunch of leaves. Now I've got a hickory, a strawberry, sweet violet, which has a beautiful heart shape to it, dogwood, and hosta plant. So make sure your leaves are big enough, but not so big that they take up the whole paper. We're going to talk a little bit about the shape of these leaves. Now, leaves come in all different shapes and sizes, and the shape and size and how it is tells you what plant it comes from, because all plants are different. One plant of one different type of species, they're all the same. Humans are a type of species. We're homo sapiens. We are all pretty much alike. We may differ a little bit in color, but we are all the same. You can see that the hickory and the sweet violet are different from each other. They are different species from each other. This hickory, all hickories are going to have the same leaves like this. All sweet violets are going to have the same leaves like this. All right, so go ahead, go out, collect some um, different kind of leaves. Leaves that are, have multiple like this on one stem are called compound. Leaves that are just all together are called simple. Some leaves may have teeth to them, these ridges that go around the edge. Some leaves may be smooth, they have no teeth on the edge at all. Alright, so go out and collect yourself some leaves. We'll see you in the next video.